Y'all, this is a poly satin camo jogger from Time and True. What on earth is happening? What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. I have a pre-fall haul, so let's talk about fall. Walmart is dropping new styles. It seems like every day right now, fall is a call-in, and it's time to get those kids back to school, dust off those autumn decorations, and get settled into some hot cocoa. I really love this time of year, although I can't quite get there yet, but I'm having a blast checking out all the possibilities that are just around the corner. So a big thank you to Walmart for sponsoring today's video and let's get into it so first up to what I have on I know this is one of the first sweaters I bought for the season but I love the way this fits we're really setting the bar high the weight of this y'all oh my goodness it is just a great transitional sweater it is an off the shoulder and it's not too bulky it has a nice form fit it could be tucked in if you want and I'm wearing it in my normal size medium it does fit true to size love the bell sleeve on this and it is a long sleeve but it kind of hits you in between a three-quarter sleeve and the wrist so it's not a ton of fabric that you're just getting lost in definitely is one of my complaints about fall fashion and later in the winter I know I'm gonna be bundled up more basically using my sleeves as gloves But this particular sweater is great for those one layer fall days It does come in a few other colors including some brighter ones And it is a cotton poly nylon blend with a ribbed knit look and because this is made to go off the shoulder You don't have a boat neck option. It fits just right sometimes off the shoulder can gap a little bit But this one is snug it stays right where it's supposed to and I'm wearing it first with the dark wash jean. I've mostly been wearing light wash throughout the spring and summer, but now it's time to mix in other denim washes. So I did pair it with a black slide and I would probably grab this little black bag here from Walmart to go with it. And y'all, it's under $15. I did show it in my 15 under $15 at Walmart video from last week. So y'all check out that one if you haven't yet. Most of the items are still in stock. And then for my next look, I swapped it out for a heel on these black trousers from Free Assembly. This is a cotton pant with 5% spandex, so there is nice give to it. I am wearing it in a size 8 and I think it fits true to size. It does have a side exposed brass zipper with a concealed button so it really elevates it to a trouser look because it has that flat front. It's great for a tuck, a blazer, really anything that you want to pair with it. They are cropped with a slight flare at the bottom which I think is universally flattering and this is a really great pant to have at the office so I also styled it with this traditional white button up. How easy is this look? This top is the career button down from Time and True. They carry it off and on all year, but really any white Oxford will work. The really fun part is adding some jewelry and these horse bit black mules from Time and True. You guys are always asking me for more workwear, and I think these are awesome. They do come in half and whole sizes, but I'm wearing my normal size nine. I also, by the way, have a wide foot and they fit me just fine. Time and True also has a really similar version in a white croc and an animal print that look very designer. They look Look like the pair during the Nordstrom sale that everyone was going nuts for so I will also link those below but these do have a silver horse bit hardware across the top it's just a little jewelry for your shoe that is really trendy right now and they are that open back mule style and of course they have the memory foam that time and true is known for but in case you're like me and trying to get back into an exercise routine I did pick up this two pack of tanks in gray and black and they are on sale right now for about nine dollars for two this is made of recycled polyester as well as the spandex these have a great stretch to them and they do have open armholes for an athletic look. So yes, you're gonna need to wear something underneath it. And I've been trying out a lot of different sports bras. This one here is from Athletic Works and it comes in about 12 different solids and patterns. This has cami style straps with removable padding. It's also adjustable and it is a racer back style. This really nice looking mesh detail in the back. It also has a wide comfort band across the bottom and there's plenty of support for my kind of workout, although I'm not a runner, so I do wanna put that out there. But the best part is it's under $10. I think that's awesome. And I went with this pattern because it matched my shoes, honestly. So these are from the brand Avia. They've been so popular, under 20 bucks. I think they have limited sizing right now, but they will restock. So make sure you subscribe here on YouTube and look out for my community tab. I post restocks there, as well as on Facebook and on IG. And I did complete that look with my little nylon crossbody from Time and True. I will go ahead and link that one below, even though I think it's an in-store purchase only. But there are a few other color options. All right, and I did want to give a shout out to the bracelet set of three for Scoop that I'm wearing in most of my outfit footage. It is a three pack of beaded elastic strands. One of them does have a heart, the other one has a star, and the third one has an evil eye. And y'all, this set of three is only 13 bucks, and we've been seeing a lot of these stackable bracelets. I'll go ahead and link a few of my other Walmart favorites below. All right, I could not resist this No Boundaries crew neck sweatshirt from the men's department. I loved the oversized feel and the color. It's kind of a putty meets beige color, and I thought this would look so great oversized in a man's medium with some distressed shorts for now. And I'm wearing it with my embellished slides from Time and True. I think I've been showing these since January or February. 
They are one of my favorite pairs of shoes. I wear them constantly. These are in stock in whole sizes and they're on sale right now for only $15. And then I'll be wearing it all fall and winter long in comfort with just a black pair of leggings and slides for now, maybe socks later. And y'all, these studded slides are still on sale for under $10. I've been wearing these nonstop. If you check out my last several YouTube videos, like half my outfits are styled with these. It's a great alternative to a flip flop. And I just love the studded detail makes them look a little bit more elevated. And in addition to the black, they also have limited stock in a pale pink color. And speaking of being comfortable, this asymmetrical romper and camo print is from Scoop. It is comfy, loungy, it's doing all the things. It is a step up from just a pajama romper because of the off the shoulder look. And I am wearing it in my normal size medium, but it does come in an extra small to a 3X. It's a rayon with spandex. It feels great on the skin. It's lightweight. And I would definitely run around in this. So don't feel like you have to just wear this at home. It does have an elasticized waist with the drawstring. And there's a lot of give and stretch to this. Plus y'all know me, I'm a sucker for a good camo print. And speaking of camo, name something I never thought I needed, but I love anyway. Y'all, this is a poly satin camo jogger from Time and True. What on earth is happening? They are sleek, they have a satin feel, lightweight with a front pleat. They are high-waisted and they're meant to have a relaxed fit. I did get these in a size medium, but I probably could have sized down if I wanted them to be just a little bit more fitted. And they do have these from an extra small to a 3X. And they also have this in a very wearable solid black. So think your little black dress, but in a pair of pants. I just cannot. I think these are so fantastic. So how I styled it first is with a form-fitting v-neck tank right now with a heel just to dress it up. But then also just a slide and a tank top in the same pant makes it feel very casual for summer. It has belt loops if you want to throw a belt on with it. And it also has these two gold buttons in the front. Later in the holiday season, this would be so great with a luxe looking sweater, maybe something sparkly and they're under $20. All right, so my next item, I did show you guys this one in beige and it was a bestseller around here for weeks and now it's on sale for $22. I also shared it recently in my Walmart clearance video and went ahead and bought it for myself in this cognac color. The website is calling this bronze. It is an open stitch niche hoodie that's kind of giving you a crochet boho feeling, especially with the hood. And even though it's on clearance, they still have most sizes. So definitely pick this up as we're transitioning to fall. You're gonna love it. And then I'm wearing it with my well-worn animal print slide that I've grabbed for all summer long. Because of the animal print and the fact that they're a darker color, I'm gonna be wearing this here in Texas for at least another month or two. And these do have a stud detail, which I think makes them look much more expensive than they are. All right, even though I wasn't prepared to try on boots just yet, I did pick up these Western faux croc boots from Scoop. They are $10 off right now, and they are more of a booty style, which I personally love. They do have a black upper with a brown block heel. And one of the things I like about this one is it doesn't have a completely pointed toe. The end is slightly squared off, which I think is going to make these a little bit more comfortable. And this detailing right here is actually an elastic extender, which does make these a lot easier to get off and on. And it gives you a little bit more room in the width of the boot, which I definitely need. Um, there is a zipper on the other side though too. So again, really easy to get these on and off. I'm wearing my normal size nine in these. And y'all, Western is here. It's going to be big. It's been teased for the last few seasons, but it has officially arrived. And this booty is a very wearable way to rock the trend. All right. The word is officially out on this next one, so hurry if you're interested. It's this plaid shirt from Free Assembly. If you're ready to get your fall on, this is gonna be your little crown jewel. It's not a heavy shacket, it's lightweight, so think more of a shirt weight. And I just love the neutral tones on this, but it also comes in a very pretty blue as well as the yellow version. And I am wearing it in my normal size medium, but this is one that I could have sized up one or two, no problem. They are getting limited sizing, and the website says this color is not coming back, so don't wait on it. And I am wearing it here with the boyfriend tee that I'm so happy is back. This is around like $8 and it fits me like a dream. It's a Pima cotton boxy style and for now I could even wear this exact same outfit and just wrap the plaid around my waist and get myself just a little bit in the mood for autumn. And I finished it off with my white sneaker from Time and True. This is the one that does have that really pretty gold accent heel. I could also see this same outfit with a white denim pant. I would love that. And I saw that Sophia has a new white ankle jean that I will also link below. I personally wore white denim straight through the fall last year and loved it. And speaking of Sophia, the jeans that I have on with the plaid shirt are the same ones I have on right now from Sophia and I love them. All of her jeans have great stretch to it and they look really designer to me. And this does have a button fly. They're a light wash style with light distressing and they do have a cute little crop. And I'm actually shocked these are still in stock. It seems like light wash crop jeans, especially at this budget of a price, are flying out the door. So this is another item that I would not wait on. And I did buy this bag after I shot that outfit but I think this casual cream bag with the exposed stitch detail 
detailing and bronze zipper would look absolutely fantastic with that shirt. Now it can be worn as a crossbody, but I do prefer it like a shoulder bag. And it has one exterior zipper on the side and then the inside is one large pouch with an interior zipper pouch and then open slots on the other. This hobo design is really trendy and the utilitarian style strap is gonna look great for casual outfits now and throughout next season. This does also come in black and the best part is it's under 20 bucks. All right, next up is this waterfall sweater from Sophia. And I just wanna give a shout out to Sophia Vergara. Her line really gets those neutral colors right in my opinion. Her beiges, her camels, and tans all look very high-end designer. So I did buy this one in camel, but it does come in a few other colors including black. And this one almost falls into the category of a duster. It's nice and long, it looked great with jeans. It's gonna look fantastic with boots this fall, but for now I did throw it on with the black tank and slides. And I'm definitely gonna be wearing this later in the season with leggings because it does cover the bump completely, even with the handkerchief hemline. And then I wore it with a basic black back to the office look. This is gonna be a great sweater for those of you guys that have chilly offices. I think this is gonna look great this winter too, especially for the office with a black turtleneck underneath. And the best part in my opinion is how soft the fabric is. This is also just a cardigan that I would throw on around my house. But I'm back home from workwear in this new lounge two-piece set from Sophia. She just launched her PJ loungewear line that I am so excited about. She has a lot of really cute things, so I will be sure to link some of my other picks below. But this one is a two-piece set. It's not a romper. The footage might have made it look like that, but you are getting two pieces, and I'm wearing it in my normal size medium. The sizes on this are from a small to a 5X, so very inclusive. And it also comes in white in a couple of pretty wild patterns, literally. I think there is a zebra as well as some leopard spot, and the fabric is really soft. It's a model cotton with 5% spandex. And for me, a long sleeve style with shorts really hits the spot, especially as I'm hanging around the house while it's still warm. These shorts, by the way, do have pockets as well as an elasticized waist and a drawstring. I'm actually leaving for Tennessee as soon as I'm done filming this video. And this comfy outfit is what I'm wearing. But for whenever it's cooler, they do also have a matching PJ jogger and a solid or a stripe, so you could get a matching stripe on this if you wanted to. I just opted for the solid black because I did want to be able to mix and match it with other pieces. I'm gonna walk my dogs in this, run an errand, whatever, especially with the black color, this is gonna go with everything. I do have this in my normal size medium. It has the same delicious fabric and these are less than 17 bucks. And with the pant, I did change it up and wear last year's zip up hoodie from Time and True. And I did see that this year's version just dropped online. They are less than $13 and they are available in a few new colors. These these always go fast, so do not wait on these. I think I was only able to show them in one or two fall videos last year before they were gone. And at 13 bucks, I always like to pick up multiples. I do have time and true hoodies in a small, like this one for that cropped look, to an XL for a baggy throw on with legging looks, and these are a steal. I see fleece lined hoodies all the time in the three digit price range. This is one that you have got to get at Walmart instead. And I also paired this with my new bag from No Boundaries. I did show you guys this in a shop with me Walmart video. And y'all, how fun is this? They are calling it a tech crossbody and it has all the little trinkets and single use pouches and charms that are everywhere. You do have all of your charms hanging off of this gold hoop, but then you do have a black strap to wear it like a crossbody. This pouch right here is a hand sanitizer holder. You do have just a little pearl heart tassel charm. And this main compartment is a cell phone holder with a zipper pouch, as well as a couple of card slots. I probably would skip using the card slots and just put stuff in the zipper pouch, but that's just me. And then this rounded compartment with a twist closure. I'm not sure what it actually is supposed to be used for, but it does fit my lipsticks and my lip balms perfectly. So that's how I use it. And this does fit my cell phone, by the way. I do have the large 12 Pro Max iPhone, but I do have a thin case, no pop socket or ring. So I'm sure that does make a difference. And the strap is not adjustable. The length on this is what you get. But this is a lot of fun for under $15. I wouldn't say that that this would be an everyday bag or anything, but for the right occasion, this would totally make an outfit. And last up, this cutout sweater. This is new from Sophia this year, and it does have this really beautiful back cutout. It also has an exaggerated puff sleeve. And when I first saw this, I thought it looked very regal, something that the royal family would wear in like the 1800s. And when I looked it up, I wasn't that far off. It is called a Lego mutton sleeve. It's a big puffy sleeve up here, and then it does go tight at the wrist. So there you go. You got to the end of the video, and we 
all learned a little something today. I did wear it with black, but I also think this would look great with a cream or a lighter colored pant. But then I did switch up my neutral color palette with accessories to these bootcut jeans from Sophia. These are the medium wash distressed version that are brand new in the Marisol style that I have shared for over a year. I think this is my fourth version of that jean. I call these my magic jeans because they make me look at least a size smaller. The boot cut really is the way to go for a slimming jean style. And I've really missed my boot cut jeans all summer. I know as we head into fall, I'm gonna be wearing these nonstop. And I did wanna give another shout out to the Time and True sweatshirt. These sweatshirts are seriously the best. I've already bought it this year in nine different colors and patterns. So another item that goes really quickly that everyone needs. So we are gonna be featuring how to style these in an upcoming Walmart video. So be sure to hit that subscribe button. If you love Walmart, there is so many styling hauls and shop with me's to come. And a big thank you to Walmart again for sponsoring today's video. Thank you guys for hanging out with me and I will see y'all in the next one.